Hello again. In this video, we're going to introduce you to another piece of kit from Keith Morris of Starsharp, and it's this. It's a solar finder. Uh, now, at this stage, I would like to just iterate that it's dangerous to look at the sun without a properly equipped telescope. That means that you need to have the correct filtering in place, either bad a solar film or purpose-built glass filtering on the end of your telescope. Definitely not the silly little 1.25 filters that they sell for screwing onto eyepieces and looking at the sun that way. Very, very dangerous and, and basically just don't use them. Uh, if you need any advice on what's the best steps to take with regards to solar viewing then you know either consult my website at astronomy shed or you know somebody else that definitely knows what they're talking about um, so on to the finder um, basically even though the sun is a great big orange ball that's like easily found in the sky it's actually quite hard to find with a telescope especially when you've got the filters in place because everything else just looks completely black until you actually hit the sun when you you know you start to just see the the, the lightened disc um, so that's where this comes in and as I said it's a solar finder now this fixes to your scope just like a normal finder does and there's a hole in the bottom and you use that to actually mount it onto your scope on the adapter that's usually on the top of one of your rings for mounting an SLR and we'll just show you a picture of, of one mounted onto a telescope Right, so how do you use it? Well, you've still got to line it up quite a bit like you do with your normal finder on your scope. And once you've got it lined up, um, which, you know, will take a little bit of effort, but once it's done, it's done. Um, it actually, it, it almost works in a dual way um, because what you get is this section here casts its own shadow onto the screen. So that is like a rough alignment. As you get in closer, the hole in the end of this casts an image of the sun onto the screen and what you do the aim is to to try and get the sun into the center of that target and when you've done that then if you've aligned it properly then your scope will be pointing directly at the sun and it's a little bit hard to explain so i'm just going to show you a video of, of it in action uh, with me out in the garden on one of the rare occasions that we have had some sun in the uk at the moment Right, as you can see, we've got there the, the main shadow of the of the back plate, if you like, and we're also showing the image of the sun. So obviously the aim of the game is to just get that image of the sun right in the centre of that circle, and that will give you your alignment. Right, as you can see, it actually works rather well, and it is one of the few pieces of Astro Kit that you can actually show working on video. Um, as is per the normal from, from Keith Morris at Starsharp, it's, it's solidly built, you know, his attention to quality is, is second to none. And I'm going to put Keith's URL up on the screen for you uh, if you want to order one of these. And again, it's another winning product from, uh, from Starsharp. So once again, thanks for watching.